Good afternoon, everybody. Hope you're having a fantastic day. Today, we're going to be looking at how I got in contact with Greg Mercer. In fact, how you can get in contact with anyone you really want to if you know these cool tips. Now, this is a live stream, so let's get started with some sort of interesting intro thing. Did it work? I hope it worked. Um, so, yeah, as I said, guys, this is a this is a live stream. So I'm just going to wait a few minutes for people to get in. It is currently Thursday. I think it's Thursday. Let me check. First, Thursday, 18th of January, two um, fourteen in the afternoon. Obviously, I do things on the hour. So uh, hopefully, people can come in. Right. So uh, let's see if all this is working. Uh, is my little thing working in the in the top left? I don't really know. Not really, not really sure. Let's, uh, <clears throat> excuse me, that little, oh, we've got eight people, eight people in this one here. Where, which one is it? Ah, oh, there it is, cool. Yeah, so, hope everyone's having a good day. Let me know if you are in. Yes, Ahmed, you are first, smiley face. When you get in, guys, give me a little heads up. Say hello when you get into the live stream, um, just to say hey. Um, I will be giving away some, some lovely money, some free money, some money on today's video, so stick around to the end for that. And I've got um, basically, basically two, two. I get not like announcement, but and they're like announcements. Finding it very hard to speak today, guys. Very hard. I'm hungry and thirsty. Um, got two kind of announcements that should be pretty interesting for you guys. What's up? What's up? What's up? Let's wait for a few more people to get in. I'm going to give it kind of like um, kind of two or three minutes. Oh, I got a notification that I'm live. Hey, look at that. I know. Um, yeah. Uh, I'll tell you what's going on over the weekend, what I've got planned for next week. So it should be a pretty interesting, pretty interesting live stream. Um, and feel free, guys, to ask me any questions you want. I want I just basically, I want to give you an update. I haven't gone live in a few days, and uh, I always like doing that because um, it's fun. It's fun. Sometimes not the most interesting videos to watch back because they're quite long, but still fun. I enjoy doing them. Renit, Kieran, Dan, Blue Checker, SC. Let's see. I'm pretty sure I know who that is. Remind me, though. Remind me. What's up, everybody? How is everyone's day going today? I know I haven't really announced this kind of live stream that well, but we don't mind. We don't care. Um, and who's seen my adverts, right? Who's seen my adverts on YouTube? I want to know. I'm, I'm kind of trialing adverts. I'm spending about £30 a day on them. Um, yeah, don't know. Might work. It might not. Omar, what's up? Female tattooed entrepreneur. What's up? Oh, shit. Johnny B is a good looking lad. Oh, thank you very much. I've been going to the gymnasium. That's right, as you can obviously tell. Uh, and I've been doing, you know, my, if, you've, if you've seen my um, goals for this year, kind of health, wealth, happiness, um, in terms of health, then I've been doing a lot more cardio at the gym. I feel thinner in the face. I feel thinner in the face. I don't know if it's a placebo, um, but I feel like when I do that, I have like less of a chin, less of a double chin. Um, but there, <laughs> there we go, thank you. Thank you for that. Um, so today's today's video is going to really be about um, <clears throat> kind of two or three things. It's really going to be about networking. That's that's the real the the kind of like the the point of this video is about networking and how incredibly powerful it is and just having the ability to reach out to someone. Right? There's people that you think will you won't be able to talk to. Um, and that will be you know, unobtainable to get in contact with. However, if you know how to get in contact and you know how to like headhunt people, what they wanna hear, how you can kind of reel them in, then that's gonna really help you on your own entrepreneurship journey because it's so important to surround yourself with people that are on the same path as you or you know for me it's important that I find people that are further ahead than me so I'm always pushing forward and of course one of the big things I do is help other people out um, and then I have my kind of my own little friendship group where we are all kind of on the same sort of level um, learning as we go so that's super important to do that and um, I think the hardest thing that people find is correct me if we're if wrong guys correct me if I am wrong the hardest thing that people find with that is trying to reach out to people that are further ahead than you in the journey, like right? getting their attention, how do you do it? So there's a few ways I'm gonna talk about today which should really help you. And basically, this is going down to how I managed to land a, um, a interview with Greg Mercer. Now, if you don't know who Greg Mercer is, he is the, the founder of Jungle Scout. Now, Jungle Scout, if you don't know, is um, 
uh, basically, excuse me, a service where it kind of indexes Amazon so you can find sales trends and stuff like that and find products to sell on Amazon. Um, and then of course you have JumpSend, you have Fetcher, which are again other tools for use on Amazon. And that all started because he was an Amazon seller and he didn't really have any of these tools around. Uh, and at the moment, I think he does four to 500,000 a month. I'm not sure if that's turnover or profit. I assume it's turnover um, with about 30 to 35 products. So he is an accomplished Amazon seller as well as an entre you know, a, a true entrepreneur that has diversified, found a need for a software and been very successful at it as well. So um, a lot of people will think, how the hell am I going to reach out to, you know, the CEO of this company, this founder of this company, this massive Amazon seller? I decided um, two days ago that in, it was in the morning. And I was like, do you know what? I want to do an interview with uh, Greg Mercer. So if you guys have you know, followed my channel for a long time, you will know that one of my past jobs was reaching out to and uh, getting in contact with CEOs of basically some of the biggest companies in the world. So I would reach out to Barclays or RBS. And this was only in the, really the finance niche. That was, my, that was kind of what I did. Um, and I would find people, I would find the CEO or the COO or CTO, basically C-level executive. Um, and that's, that's, I wouldn't go any lower than that reach out to them, get in contact with them, get them on the phone and basically pitch them uh, like a sales pitch. And basically they would then be like, hell yeah. Um, and it's, you know, it's very successful at that. So I know how to get in, con in contact with people. And these are things that I can teach you. And it's, it's honestly, it's not very hard. It's just having confidence uh, in yourself, right? And in your own ability. So I've got some notes, right? I wanted to write some things down, make sure I, go I do um, kind of cover everything. Okay. Now, I will tell you how I did it, but I'm gonna tell you the tips first, okay? Tips first, and if you get any questions, then just ping them out and I'll, I'll answer them for you, okay? I'll answer them for you. So the first thing you gotta figure out is, okay, um, you know, first of all, who, who are you gonna get in contact with? How are you gonna get in contact with them? You need to get their email address, you need to get maybe their support email address or the marketing email address or their IG um, account, their Twitter account, their Facebook account, their LinkedIn profile. So how are you gonna get in contact with them? Don't just rely on one like means of getting in contact, Get all of them, okay? Because someone might use LinkedIn way more than they use Twitter, or someone might use Twitter way more than they do Instagram. So there are different ways. Just do a little bit of research, see which platform they use the most, and um, that's how you can start to reach out to them. Uh, and again, just reach out to them. Now, what would you reach out to them with? Um, so for example, with this one, sorry, my cat, uh, with, with Greg and uh, a few other people that I've reached out to, I, for Greg Mercer, I actually sent an email to Jungle Scout. So um, I have lots of different email addresses for Jungle Scout. I have their support email, I have their like affiliate email. Um, so I just actually sent an email to their generic email address. And um, you know, I won't ex explain exactly what I said, but I explained a little bit my, about myself and why I wanted to get in contact with Greg. And I, what I didn't do is ask for an interview then and there, um, or even kind of pitch that. What I did was planted the seed and gave them a reason to pass my information on to the next person. Now, this isn't my ideal method of doing this. However, I couldn't find his email address. And uh, normally you, you, you can really find email addresses or you can guess them. It'll be like greg at you know, junglescout.com. It might be, I don't know. Um, so I said, you know, can you put me in touch with the relevant team or the relevant person that looks after scheduling or looks after marketing for Greg and see if we can, if we can talk about booking something in and talk about um, you know, what value we can, we can provide. Uh, it's because I'm a UK entrepreneur. A lot of UK residents want to find out a lot more about Jungle Scout. They want to hear from you because there's not that much on, on, um, on YouTube from the UK perspective. So for them, it's a great opportunity to get more customers um, and I obviously planted the seed that I was an affiliate for them and um, that I've used them for a long, long time. So there's the, the kind of loyalty there. And uh, what did I say? Um, and of course, uh, about a couple of months ago, they launched JumpSend in the European market. So again, that's a great reason for them wanting to promote their services on UK um, YouTube channels. So I, I put that in there, I put a really professional email together, sent it over, and very quickly, like Jungle Scout, they always get back to me very quickly, which is why I like them. They then said, okay, I'm going to forward you to, um, you know, Greg's assistant or um, a scheduling assistant. I can't remember exactly the, the, the name um, of the, the job role, but I think it was someone from marketing. Now, in my previous job, I would never speak to marketing. I would actually... 
I, you know, for the biggest companies in the world, they're normally run by their marketing teams, which is a bit of a shame because they don't make the best decisions. Um, but normally I wouldn't speak to anyone from marketing. If, if they said, oh, you have to speak to your marketing team, I just wouldn't. It just wouldn't. I want to speak to the decision maker. However, with this one, because it's a smaller company, I thought it would be easier to get to that those people, and it would normally be one person that looks after that. So it was nice and easy. <clears throat> oh, right. Let's have a little look. See if you've got any questions What's happening. What's your cardio routine? I will tell you in a minute. Can't wait for the Tanner interview. I will talk about that in a bit. And this is this is why networking is so important, guys. Right. Um, and I'm going to explain like why the Tanner interview and the Greg, the Greg Mercer interview are like why they would do it and why they would do it with me as well. Because there's some like for example, my Instagram is not very big, which is but I'm doing my interview on Instagram um, with Tanner later today. So why would he do that, right? What's the benefit for him? What's the benefit for me? So this is really important when you're networking. You've got to make sure you understand and you empathize with the other person and what, what they need from you. Okay, that's super important. Uh, anyway, so I did all that. Uh, they got in touch with me and we booked it in for, it's going to be, now this is super important, guys. If you want to see this, okay, and it's going to be a good interview, I've got a lot of research. And if you want to put any questions down below, right, if you want any questions, um, just can you send me an email or you can put it in my Facebook groups because obviously the chat right now will disappear and um, so I want to make sure I get all the questions. But for example, I've, I've got probably about 15 questions here that people have you know, suggested like, um, like how do you manage all the logistics of your businesses? What motivates him to um, you know, create the, the Jungle Scout app? What does he think about paint issues? Um, will Alibaba um, selling straight to Amazon be an issue over time? How will Amazon... Uh, affect the Jungle Scout business as they as they change as they change their business and as they change their um, kind of code of conduct con conduct. Uh, how did you develop Jungle Scout? Did you hire external developers? How long did it take? Um, you know, what are your best tips for for scaling an Amazon business to you know the five hundred thousand a month mark? So some of these are like really important questions because remember, guys, he is an uh, an accomplished Amazon seller as well as someone that has run you know their own company in terms of a, a digital product, uh, which is super important. So if you have any questions, make sure you get them over to me. The interview, okay, the interview is going to be on Wednesday. Um, so it's going to be on Wednesday, the 24th of January. Now, I'm not going to do this live. I am going to pre-record it um, just because I'd rather it be pre-recorded because they get more views. <laughs> pre-recorded videos get more views. And I want to rank it, and I don't want to have that three-minute buffer at the beginning where kind of no one's on the live stream. I want to make sure that it's value from the beginning till the end. Uh, we have an hour booked in. The interview will probably be about uh, you know, 30 to 40 minutes. So I can obviously make sure it's set up and maybe have a chat with him before or after. Now, why, why is this so influential to me? Okay, it's important to me because I get to network, right? There's, there's two reasons this is important to me. First is I get to network with, with someone that is inf very influential in the space, okay? Because he owns Jungle Scout, he runs it and multiple other services and is an accomplished Amazon seller has their Jungle Scout, uh, you know, YouTube channel, that sort of stuff. So having him on my channel, although it will give them some exposure and uh, it will get maybe the people in the UK, because about 75 to 80% of, of the audience, you guys, are from the UK. So it's going to allow people to um, kind of understand who he is, get to know him. And that will basically, that will, that will sell them more that will sell the, their product a lot more because you get to know them. All the other services, you don't really know the founders, you don't know the CEOs, they're just kind of copycats of Jungle Scout. Um, so it's really, really gonna help uh, their own business going forward because even though I haven't got a massive following, you know, three and a half or 3,800 um, subs, um, it's more exposure, well, it's better than nothing, right? It's better than nothing. So that's a benefit for, 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 for me in that sense. But also, I'm gonna be giving you guys a lot of value because I'm gonna be asking questions that you actually want the answers to. And um, I think that's gonna be really valuable for you guys, for my channel, for me as well. I'll probably learn a lot. And I think it's gonna be a good thing. But as well, I get to network with Greg Mercer, the you know, founder of, of Jungle Scout, and you never know where that can go in the future. Okay, you never, never know. I would have, to be honest, I would have paid for the interview. If they said, okay, we, we know we, we charge for interviews, I'd be like, okay, how much is it? Find out how much it is and maybe think about doing it because paying for someone's time paying for an interview can open the door 
get your foot in the door and open up that time where you can build a rapport and you can get to know that person in the future. For example, let's move this over to my interview later today on Instagram, okay? Make sure you're following me on Instagram, guys. It's down, you know, in the description, we've got the, um, the handle. I'll be going live with Tanner J. Fox. Again, he is a millionaire. He, <laughs> he has Amazon stores. He's big in, like, crypto now. Um, of course, he's personal branding expert. He's done very well within the last 12 months, literally the last 12 months, gone from kind of just doing his Amazon business to having like 80,000 subscribers, generating a significant amount of income off that. So he really knows what he's doing. Now, I originally got to know him because I bought his course, I got into his mastermind group, and over time, didn't happen straight away, over time, just got to know him a little bit more. I didn't kind of badger, you know, badger him for time, didn't kind of ask too many questions, but every now and again, we just ask a question, get a response, say ho, you know, hi, you know, thank you for this, thank you for that. <clears throat> and over time, you know, I can now contact him and say, hey, can we do an interview on my channel, uh, on my Instagram? The benefit for you is going to be, you know, we're going to talk about personal branding, about your course, about how it's been, about, you know, get people to know you a little bit better from that perspective and a little bit more intimate than, than maybe he would have it on on YouTube. And of course, the benefit for me, and I was totally transparent with him, I would show you the message. Um, no, I won't show you the message. But I said that, you know, the benefit for me is that when I go live with someone on Instagram, it notifies both my followers and your followers so that I will be able to basically get more followers from doing this because it's a new Instagram profile for me. So I said, look, the benefit for you is that. We can talk about how he's helped me because he has a lot. Um, kind of starting on my channel, getting the most out of it, giving me tips, um, not just on his YouTube channel, but, on, you know, in the mastermind group. So I'm, I'm you know, incredibly thankful for that. So... I can, I can talk about that in an actual, like, an honest way and not just say, oh, it's really great. Uh, I can genuinely say that. So th there's, there's benefits for both people. And because I've built up that goodwill over the space of months, um, you know, I just sent him, a, sent him a message, sent him a message on WhatsApp. Let's book something in. So that's important. That, that is like networking is so important. If you reach out to people, and you have a reason for reaching out to them, and you've like preempted the the value that they will want in return, then it's very likely that you'll get in contact with that person, okay? Very, very likely. How do you get an interview with you? You have to ask, just send me an email. Again, just do that exact thing. Like again, there's gotta be a reason for it. There's gotta be a reason. Um, there's, some, there's got to be some sort of benefit for both people. There's got to be some sort of, you know, trade in that sense. Uh, but yeah, you just have to reach out to me. There's no, you know, everyone has my email address. It's just in my description. You can contact me on any platform whatsoever. You know, the the, th the only thing that I would not do, guys, the only thing that I would not do is say to someone like, like say if someone came to me, you know, um, I'll do, uh, you know, if you give me access to your course, and then I can do a review on it and an interview with you and you can make more sales, right? That's actually beneficial for them, not me, um, because they'll be basically getting a course for free. And I've, I've been asked this question many, many, many times. And I, I, yeah, it just doesn't make sense. But people ask me all the time, can I have your course for free? I'll do a YouTube video on it. And uh, yeah, you get some free exposure. But actually, that person gets a free course, and then they would get affiliate commissions on any money they earn. Doesn't that doesn't actually benefit me really at all? Um, it, it just doesn't. It just doesn't. It benefits them way more than it benefits me. So what you want to do is make sure that 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 you equal out those those um, the value there, so that both people have a good reason. So you've just got to you've got to empathize with the other person and figure out what they want. Uh, again, that's just sales. That's just scare sales. Don Pedro just subscribed. Thank you, Don. You are, you are a gentleman. Thank you for that. <laughs> I wonder if he's watching. What's up, Connor? Christopher, what's up? Dan, hi there, do I know you? I think, I think you do, maybe. Uh, what are the key principles of getting a brand recognized, recognized from scratch? Um, first of all, have a good brand, have a story. Um, the, the best brands have a story, okay, and it's something that people can relate to. And so that's the best place to start, good design, don't make it look rubbish. And then, to be honest with you, it's brand awareness, which is advertising. You've just got to get your brand out there again and again and again and again, which is why people advertise. Charlie, what's up? I don't think so. 
I don't know what I'm answering. Could have give loads of value for testimonials. Yeah, it could do, yeah. I don't know, yeah, I don't know what that means. Value for testimonials. Brand, brand awareness is more about people seeing your brand over and over again. And the more they see it, the more they uh, get kind of desensitized by what it is. So that means that when a product comes up that you can buy, they're like, oh yeah, I know this brand. Yeah, cool, I'll, uh, I'll go and buy that. Been following you for some time, forgot to sub. <laughs> Who, who's forgetting to sub? Don, it was you. Make sure you hit that red button, the subscribe button, guys. So let's make sure, let's make sure, uh, I'm gonna do a giveaway in a second, guys. Make sure that you have this in your calendar. Okay, so 8 p.m. tonight on Instagram. You better be following, right? Either follow Tanner or me and make sure you have notifications turned on. <clears throat> uh, I'll be going live with Tanner. Uh, if you have any questions, make sure you send them to me. Send me a direct message with any questions you'd like me to ask. Um, of course, within reason. Uh, so that's gonna go on tonight. And then make sure again, you have the notifications turned on for the video that is gonna be next Wednesday. I hopefully I should have enough time to edit it and get it up by my kind of normal upload time. If not, it might be a bit later or the next day. I don't quite know yet, but it should be, a, <clears throat> it should be up on Wednesday. Cardio routine. So my cardio routine is just 20 minutes on like a cross trainer or running machine or rowing machine. <laughs> Three times a week. It's not very interesting. I know, but uh, I'm, I'm I'm just trying to build up my fitness level uh, Yeah, so it's just three times a week at least 20 minutes and then what I do is I take pictures of the workout after I've completed it For example Just like that, okay, so it's, oh, don't know what I just did there What the hell just happened? Don't really know what just happened. And let me get that back again. There we go, just like that, of the machine. So that I can take, I can have a track of it and I can actually stay accountable. So, and also I can track this on a graph so I can see, you know, in 20 minutes today, I did 2.1 kilometers. And then over time, hopefully I'll be able to do more with higher incline and stuff like that. So I'm gonna track that over time. <clears throat> Will the YouTube be put onto YouTube after? Um, if the Tanner interview on Instagram, no, it will only be available for 24 hours on my Instagram. That will be it. Uh, it will not be available ever again. So that's why you need to be you need to be on it, basically. I'm also doing a giveaway on that video as well, um, which would be pretty cool. I think I'm giving away like $20 or something like that. Uh, but that, again, if you're on Instagram, you have to be able to either watch it live or within the first 24 hours. Otherwise, it will be gone. It will not be there anymore. So it's a really good time to get to talk to, to him and ask questions in a more kind of intimate environment rather than on, like on YouTube, because he has such a huge amount of people asking him questions all the time, he has to be very quick with the answers um, because to get through everyone's questions. So it's not quite gonna be the same on Instagram. Um, so it should be, should be all right. Are you based in the UK? Uh, yes, I'm based in the UK, currently in Watford, which is, it's not the nicest of places, I wouldn't say it's, the nicest of places. It's it's average. It's like an average place. Um, tomorrow I'm off to London to meet fellow entrepreneurs. I will actually video the day. Uh, I'm doing some like photography shots and just general uh, kind of bants. Uh, so yeah, I'll be doing that tomorrow. I will film that. I have an upload ready for tomorrow, which is actually about YouTube. It's about it's about. I'm not even gonna tell you. It's but it's about YouTube and it's quite an interesting one uh, that I recorded today. So uh, I'll have another video up tomorrow. <clears throat> but guys, have you got any questions for me? Sorry, I've got a bit of a cough at the moment. Got a bit of a cough. Have you got any questions for me before we go? Because I'm gonna wrap this up in five minutes. But before we do, can you just put in the comments, if you wanna win some money, uh, I'm gonna give away, again, $20 or about 15 pounds worth um, of money uh, to one of you guys that are watching right now. Just leave a, leave a five, press five. Right, and press enter, right? And then I'll, I'll pick someone. I'm gonna send you some send you some cash. And I've got a giveaway tomorrow and on the day after as well. Uh, if you could choose to live, live, uh, if you could choose anywhere to live, oh, is the stream okay? Uh oh. Yeah, if you could choose anywhere to live, uh, where would it be? 
I don't really know. No idea. Yeah, I have no idea. I have no idea. I, I don't I'm I don't really get tied to places. I like being at home, but if I then move, I'll just be like that's my new home. I don't really mind particularly where I am. I just want to have good links to get places. I don't want to be stuck inside or stuck in like a town or something. Um I would like to live in a hot country. Um, but at the same time, I wouldn't like to live away from like family and stuff like that. Why don't you record it? Because I can't record it on Instagram and at the same time um, be able to hear and stuff like that. I could use my phone to record it, but I might run out of storage. So, um, but also, that's just the power. That's just what's happening. That's just what's happening. It's only going to be available for 24 hours. Uh, the one with Greg Mercer, I will, I will be recording it, making sure it's edited and stuff like that so that the questions kind of arrive if there's any audio issues. Um, and then I'll be uploading it because I want the production quality on that one to be you know, better than a live stream, okay? Um, because I would want to rank that video for like interview with Greg Mercer, um, UK, whatever. Based in London, cool. Whereabouts in London? Are you looking about getting into retail? Uh, no. Retail, like retail arbitrage. Um, press it. No, put five. Press five. Press five and then press it. <laughs> Guys, you crack me up. Uh, advice on networking with other UK entrepreneurs. Reach out to them. Um, give them some sort of value. Do a trade of skills. Find out what they're good at, what they need help with. And if you can help, then you can help. Right. There's got to be a there's got to be a reason for doing it. Okay, there's got to be a reason for doing it. But you, if you don't ask, you don't get. You just need to reach out to people, and you know, have a genuine positive intent. Right? What? Have a you know, ha, of course, have a reason, but have positive intent. Right? Positive intent. Uh, retail arbitrage? No, nah, I'm not. I'm not going to do retail arbitrage. I've actually got like loads of stuff I could sell. Retail arbitrage, literally sitting under my desk. Um, but I can't be bothered. I can't be bothered. That's the, that's the long and short of it. Like today, um, today I, I started all my PPC for my Amazon campaign, uh, and I've done thirteen. I've done thirteen units today. Like I've done thirteen units. I've sold. You know what's that? Uh, One hundred ninety-five pounds worth or whatever. And I haven't done anything for it. This is super important. If I had to go and post all of the this like the products that I've got under my desk then it would take time, it's have to print labels, take them to the post office, pay for it. It's just a pain in the ass. Like I'm all about passive income, <laughs> just doing work up front and then get paid, you know, get paid ongoing. So this is why like, FBA is perfect for me because you know I can just look at my phone, update it, and be like, oh sweet, I've sold 13 units today. Like awesome. Didn't do anything for it. Okay, we got some fives, we got some sorries. <laughs> we got a yo. <clears throat> Press five, lol. <laughs> uh, real estate. Excuse me, guys. Kieran, you have won, mate. You have won. Uh, can you email me info at johnnybradley.com? Kieran Kane. I need your PayPal email address. The currency as well. Excuse me. Excuse, excuse me, guys. The currency and of, yeah, your PayPal email address, currency from your email at info at johnnybradley.com. So I'm so confused. Yeah, Kane, uh, sorry, Kieran Kane. You have won, my friend. Um, and real estate, to answer your question, all real estate, yes. Uh, I, I currently have, uh, this house I am in at the moment is rented. I rent the place I'm in right now, and I own somewhere that I rent out. Okay, so I have a house, it's a two-bedroom kind of semi-detached house. Um, I rent that out to people. I've made probably about 50 grand on the actual house itself, and then had the rental income uh, as well. I've had it for about two years. I do look, I'm, I'm looking to get another house or a flat. From Surrey, okay, I used to be in uh, Kingston upon Thames, which is in Surrey. It's a nice place, nice place. So let's make sure, uh, did, it, did everyone hear that? Did everyone hear the winner? Did everyone hear the winner? Make sure we did hear that. <coughs> Excuse me. Having a bit of a, bit of a coffee day. Right, so who's gonna, be, who's gonna be joining? Who's gonna be joining me later today on Instagram? Give me a little one in the comments if you're gonna be joining me later on at eight o'clock, Greenwich Mean Time, UK time on Instagram for the interview with Tanner. Let me know, guys. I want to make sure that I see your names 
in there. I'm also, again, on the post itself, if you look at the latest post, guys, this is important. We're just giving away all sorts of stuff. I love giving away money. I also like keeping it. But that's, that's uh, you've got to give to, to receive or something. Right, so I uploaded this picture, okay? This picture earlier today, okay? Make sure you go onto my Instagram profile, okay? And you comment, right? Read the instructions. Comment TJ Fox letter by letter, and that'll enter you, and you've got to save the post as well. Saving the post is this button just here, right? That button just there, if you save it, <clears throat> and obviously like it. Then uh, I'm gonna give away $20. I'm gonna PayPal someone $20 on the live stream, okay? So you enter yourself by commenting on the photo. Who just subscribed? Lord's Wood, 24 just subscribed. Oh my goodness, thank you so much. I'm gonna, I, I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna refresh that one. We're gonna do that again. Oh yes, look at it, it's great. You like the little kitty guys. What do you prefer, the kitty or the face? What do we like more? Uh, yeah, so you've got, to, you've got to comment on that to put yourself forward, and I will announce the winner on the live stream. If you're not on the live stream, then you will not be rewarded with the money. <laughs> uh, burnt my lunch inside the oven while I was watching this video. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Never want to give away before. You have today. You have today. First of many, hopefully. Wimbledon, yes, like Wimbledon. Yeah, Wimbledon is a lovely place. Uh, I'm gonna sneak at work. <laughs> sneak in there. I watched the repost, I won't be able to watch it live. Don't worry, don't worry. Again, make sure you do watch it within 24 hours though, because otherwise it'll just disappear. I'm gonna have lunch now, but thank you. Make sure, Kieran, you email me, your PayPal, PayPal, PayPal email address and the currency, and I'll get that over to you today. Um, but that's it guys, that is it, that is it for today. Hopefully you've enjoyed this live stream. Uh, you got some value out of it. Just kind of, my final thoughts are make sure that you understand the power of networking, that again, you surround yourself, <clears throat> you surround yourself with, with not only like like-minded people, but people that can like push you forward, okay? And people that you can learn from. And the only way that you're gonna do that is if you put yourself out there, if you're approachable yourself, but also if you, if you can't, you've got to contact people, you can't expect people to contact you um, when there's no need for them to do so, okay? So contact them, give them a reason to speak with you or uh, network with you, and you'll find that, that over time, you will generate a really good network of people around you that you, can, that you can learn from. My goal here is to get closer to the people that are further ahead than me so I can learn from them. Because you know, if you surround yourself right, I always got taught that <clears throat> if your four, your four best friends or your four people you spend most time with are idiots, you are the fifth, okay? You're the fifth idiot because you're hanging around with five videos. And that's not a kind of like an, an intelligence level or anything like that. Um, it's kind of like, you know, if you surround yourself with four athletes, you're probably gonna end up being an athlete. If you surround yourself by four musicians, you're probably gonna be a musician. If you surround yourself by four people with no drive and like no ambition, you're probably not gonna have a lot of drive and ambition because that's the norm in that social circle. However, if you surround yourself with millionaires, if you surround yourself with um, highly successful people, then you probably might end up being a millionaire or very highly successful. It's just you've got to get in contact with them first, okay? And it takes time. You can't just go like, oh, I'm earning you know, zero a month and now I'm gonna go network with you know, four millionaires. It doesn't quite work like that. You just need to just gradually work your way up and and as you do that, your social circle will come up with you. You'll help other people kind of uh, build themselves up at the same rate as you. And that's where the kind of really rewarding factor comes in. Um, who won? It was Kieran. Kieran Kane. That's harsh. What's harsh? Uh... <laughs> what, the, the four idiots thing? Yeah, I'm, not, I'm not saying like actual like idiots or whatever, but that's always what I got told, right? Um, I don't know where I heard it. It's probably from YouTube. Um, but the, the point is, it's, it's the kind of, you are who you surround yourself with. And that's the really important thing.
So I want to surround myself with, with people that push me forward. I want to surround myself with people that have um, a higher level of income than me. I want to surround myself with people that have a higher enjoyment of life, that uh, you know appreciate things maybe more than I do, that have uh, maybe w- more wisdom than I do. So those are the people I want to surround myself with so that I can learn from them and that I can adapt my own personality to Uh, my own habits to get to the point where they are right now and at the point when I get to the point where they are they'll be way ahead of me still which is fine Um, but at in the same time my little network of people that I spend time with will learn from what I've done and I'm going to learn from what they have done and who they network with uh, which will then bring us up as as a little group and then everyone that I'm helping will come up at the same rate because they have the contact with me uh, and everyone benefits from this kind of social network in that sense this professional network and that's how people progress that's mostly how people get promotions and mostly how people um kind of learn new skills is by by being introduced to them by other people um you know you can do it by yourself i'm not saying that you need this i'm just saying it's a lot easier to 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 progress to the point where you want to be if you have people helping you and you're helping other people so that's, that's kind of my thoughts on that. But guys, I hope you have enjoyed today. Hope you enjoyed today. Can you just smash that like button if you're still watching? Congrats, Kieran, on the giveaway. Make sure, you're, again, you're on Instagram later today. Make sure you have those notif- notifications turned on for the interview with Greg next week. Uh, and in terms of more content, I've got a few things coming uh, over the next few days, which should be pretty interesting. As usual, hopefully, you will like that content. Guys, I've hoped you enjoyed it. I will see you all, I'll see you all tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye.